At Manchester City, the spotlight has fallen on a 24-year-old Evertonian who has something of a point to prove to new boss Howard Kendall. Ian Bishop began his career at Goodison under Kendall, but was sold to Carlisle with only 20 minutes of first-team football under his belt. Now the faces are five years older, but Kendall brings with him to Main Road his own ideas and his own players, and Bishop still can't forget the way he left Goodison. He told me that I'd be probably sixth in line for the first-team place. And as I say, at that stage, at 19, uh, you know, you, you can't wait any longer. It's, you, you've got to be doing something. And I felt like league football was, was more important. What were your thoughts when he, he was appointed Manchester City boss? Um, I thought it was great for the club, to be honest. Um, Personally? <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I always admired his training um, methods and the way he played. And it always suited me. So that way I did, yeah. But did you think, oh no, it's not going to happen again? There's been uh, a little doubt, yeah. But it's a totally different situation. And I'm a totally different player now, a different person. And we're really starting from scratch. That's the way I look at it. In a disappointing season, Ian Bishop has at least been one city success. He'll tell you at first he was overawed when he signed, but now the confidence is increasing. They say you, you can't score goals though, don't they? <laughs> That's me who says that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've got three. I seem to have dried up a little bit just lately. Um, I don't even seem to be getting the chances. So there's something I'm doing different, something I'm doing wrong. And we'll have to put our finger on it and, and if I'm playing, <laughs> get it sorted out. Howard Kendall saw Bishop create City's only goal against Southampton last week. The fans have certainly taken to him. Ian Bishop's hope now is that Howard Kendall takes him back to Everton on Sunday. Do you think you deserve to be in the team? Um, on the last performance, I don't really think so. With Reedy coming, if Reedy hadn't have come, I'd have maybe said, you allowed a bad game and, and you get your chance and get your chance again to put it right, which is what happens through the season. But Peter Reed will probably play. Peter Reed will play, probably, yeah. I just hope I'm alongside him. Peter, do you appreciate that it can be difficult for young, inexperienced midfield players to actually express themselves uh, alongside a strong personality such as yourself? I think um, that's part of their character as well. I think they've got to go out there and at the end of the day I'm only a team member like anybody else and, and 11, it's not one player, two players, there's 11 lads out there and they've all got to take equal responsibility. If you're in a team, you're old enough and you're good enough. You've got to do the business. Ian Bishop, for example, doesn't seem to know whether your arrival is a good thing or a bad thing from his point of view. Well, Bish is uh, obviously an old from his Everton days. Technically great feet, good player. I mean, uh, he's just got to get his head up. He's got to fight for his place and then you never know. But I don't pick the team. The gaffer picks the team. And um, that's the way it is, isn't it? What is it about Howard Kendall that made you pack your bags at Queen's Park Rangers and, and come hot foot to join him? Well, I signed for... Howard at Everton, I think it's about seven years ago this week, if I'm not mistaken. And um, I just enjoy his, his training. His, uh, he sees things in football and he's a, he's a good man manager. I mean, oh, we, had happy, we had good times, successful times at Everton. I just want to try and do the same again at Manchester City. Um, I mean, it's going to be an emotional occasion for all of you on Sunday, isn't it? Can it be just another game, as they <laughs> say? Yeah, um, it is. Yeah, I mean, going back to Goodison for the Alan Arp, all of us is going to be. It, it is. It's going to be. It's a coincidence in football brings in, but we've just got to get out there and we've got to do the business. I think for for ninety minutes, it's it's a battle, and and we've got to do the business.